When you get your new pole, what you're gonna to need to do is you're gonna to need to elasticate the top kit. So take your top kit out of your pole and then you'll notice that a lot of modern poles have got these side pullers. So this is where we're gonna start. First things first, the few things that you need to elasticate your pole. Some elastic, I chose 12 to 14 slick elastic. There's a few carp in here and I know it'll handle them perfectly. Some Dacron connectors, this is where you're gonna attach your pole rig to and another essential piece of equipment. A couple of other items, some puller beads to stop the elastic by the puller. And you've got a little puller tool which will help you just to get these beads onto your elastic. Finally, scissors. You don't want to be biting elastic with a teeth, so we've got some scissors to help us. So let's have a look at where we're starting. Let's grab our elastic out and have a look. Elastic choice is quite specific to where you're fishing, um, but if you're fishing for carp in the sort of two to five pound bracket, 12 to 14 slick elastic is a perfect choice to start off with. So what I've got, I've got one end of my elastic and what I'm gonna do is put a puller bead on this. So I'm gonna grab myself a bead out of the packet and then what I wanna do is put our puller tool through the thick end of the bead, out the smaller end, like so. Put your elastic into the puller and pull your bead onto the elastic. Pull a little bit through, and all I'm gonna do is tie a quick loop in the end of my elastic, and this knot will stop your elastic pulling through. So pull your knot down tight, take your scissors, just trim the tag end a bit, and pull that in. So our bead's on, and that's gonna stop the elastic going through the pole. Now let's go down, grab the other end of our elastic, and start threading it through our pole. So we're gonna grab the thicker end of your top kit, look for the puller, and pass the elastic through the slot, the slot on the top kit, and just thread your elastic all the way down and out the end. So with a new pole, this is a really easy task, and it'll come straight out. So grab the other end, pull the elastic all the way through, and as you can see there, the bead is stopping it pulling through the puller. Next, we're gonna grab the thinner top section, go from the thick end and pass your elastic down here. Thread it right the way down, nice and easy. There we go, so we're threading our elastic all the way down until it pops out the end. So, making sure you've got the other end of your elastic. Now what we're going to do is attach the Dacron connector which will allow us to attach our rig. So, we'll get our Dacron connector out of the packet. Now these come on a nice little plastic sleeve, all ready to slide straight over, to, over your elastic. So just take it off the sleeve, like so, and pass your elastic through that bead and then all I'm going to do is I'm going to tie one simple granny knot with two, pass it through twice, just moisten it slightly, pull it down tight so we've got a nice little knot in our elastic. And then all we need to do then is pull the Dacron connector, the Dacron on the Dacron connector down tight up to the back of the knot and slide the bead over the elastic. So the knot is all hidden inside, really nice and easy. Take your scissors, just trim off the tag end, and there we have it. Nice and neat, your top kit's ready to go, elasticated, all we need to do is get our rig, attach it to the top kit, and get fishing.